And one night I was wired. Not high, not happy, just numb. So I posted an ad online saying that anyone could come around at me, and anyone, and I'd be waiting. And people showed up. And my only condition was that they didn't speak. And these people, I don't remember much about them, but there were these two older guys. They arrived together. I didn't turn them away, I didn't ask anything of them. I just reminded them of my rule, not to speak. They must have thought their luck was in. I just don't remember what happened that night. I look back and I don't recognize that person. Have you decided? Jesus Christ! Who are you? Here we go again. My name no, is- I know what your name is. How do you know me and how do you keep finding me? Have you decided? Who are you? Have you decided? Who the fuck are you? Is that what you want? You're smoking and drinking and fucking around. Is that what you want? No. I don't really believe in therapy and its power. Right. Well, I, I thought, might as well talk to someone, you know. Why not speak to your friends? Well... <sighs> I, I... I can't. But these guys are professionals, you know, at least, at least they can try and help fix me. I'll tell you what, mate, they are thousands. All they do is sit there and it's people's bullshit. I would tell everyone to come to therapy if I was them, wouldn't you? <laughs> Yeah. So, why are you here? Court ordered therapy. And therapy's a problem? Yeah, yeah, it really is. Think what you want, mate. But they just didn't make you send me here and they'll fix me. They just force me to sit there and talk about my problems while they sit there and say nothing. I hate it. It does absolutely no good to me. All I'm doing is expressing myself. I have my anger all under control. 